Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be covering the effects of GABA supplementation on the production of growth hormone in the body. GABA is essentially a neurotransmitter in the central nervous system, but uh, this is not our point of interest today. Our main objective is its effects on the secretion of growth hormone. A year 2008 study covered this topic profoundly. A double-blind placebo-controlled study was made up of 11 male participants. The experiment consisted of multiple training bouts and rest periods, which were done after the ingestion of either 3 grams of placebo, plain sugar, or 3 grams of GABA. Blood samples were collected up to 90 minutes after the training session and after the rest periods and the groups which were given GABA had approximately a 400% increase in growth hormone at rest and 200% increase after training. I perceived from this research that taking GABA after workout would yield greater benefits since you usually rest following a workout. I started taking 3 grams after workout. After weeks of usage, I decided to do a blood test and just out of curiosity, I included growth hormone in that test. The results were shockingly accurate. I had exactly 400% increase of my growth hormone from baseline levels. Nowhere near the levels you would have taking exogenous growth hormone. But for a natural, a natty, it's a good boost. I hope this video was helpful to you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Have a great week and stay strong.